G'day, welcome to the channel. If it is your first time, thanks for tuning in. Uh, you're with the Pedal Picassos, I'm Rod. Uh, hit subscribe, uh, give us a thumbs up, drop a comment in below. More in the series of Moscow Audio Compact Amp Emulator Pedals. This is a take on Joyo, uh, AC Tone, their American sound um, series, which is also a take on Tech 21 Sans Amp. Um, who perhaps were one of the first amp emulators in a in a stomp box. Really good value pedals. I've done uh, a video on, on each on their own. I've compared each of them to the Joyo equivalent and now I'm putting each of them beside each other so you can hear the differences between each. So the F dash Dur emulating Fender range of amplifiers and the AC30 uh, emulating the, the Vox AC30. All right, this is the, uh, well, this is Strat uh, with Gen 4 noiseless pickups going straight into GarageBand. Very dull, very lifeless. F dash do. A little bit of break up there. Bit of break up. Yes, you can get them much cleaner. Very clean. Cool. All right, I'll get the AC30 clean as well. Seems to be more bottom end in the fender. Of course, I've got more bottom end wound in. I'm winding that back out. In all fairness, I should set all EQs flat so you can hear each of them and hear the tone difference um, just by gain staging. Get all these at noon. Right out. The AC30 has more natural breakup. Now I've got the drive set about the same, I've got the voice set about the same. Level set the same, EQ's flat. <laughs> Definite uh, EQ difference, different tonality to them both. Um, The, the Fender is a little bit um, more robust all around sort of bottom end and giving you that confidence to um, to funk around. Uh, the AC30 has a different type of compression which is a bit short, it doesn't linger. But it's got more of a rock tone, more of a rock. Natural rock tone, and that's how I would set these up if I was using them in a live situation or even a recording situation. I would be using one as a rock tone, one as a clean palette that you can gain stage before. Um, I might actually swap these around if I'm going to be cascading one into the other because you can. And you can get three tones with this, right? So you can have a clean sound. And then a, a rockier tone. 
and I would wind up the drive. Voice it a little bit sharper. And then be able to cascade them together for a solo tone. And you always want to have one of those tones that sounds like you're falling downstairs with your amplifier on fire. Just on that edge of just total chaos. <laughs> I reckon they're uh, great bits of kit. Um, regardless of the price, regardless of where they're manufactured, you've got the option to have an ampless rig. Um, and for this price, <laughs> you know, for, for about $50, $60 each, you can have an AC30 emulation. And a Fender emulation. Hey, we might just do the Marshall one next. What do you think? Thanks for tuning in. Um, drop a comment in below. Let us know if you've got these. Considering. Uh, yeah, just be part of the conversation. We'll see you next time, yeah?